so now we're going to go ahead and take a look at this 4-in-1 gas detector. And this was sent to us by Toptis. So we really appreciate you uh, sending this to us. And we're going to go ahead and open this up and take our first look at it. First thing out of the box, it's got this hard case, uh, which I like. Uh, if you chose to take this out in the field in this case, um, I think this would hold up pretty good. Easy to clean off. This one looks pretty nice. So we'll go ahead and open it up. Inside we have uh, the user manual here. This is a Guard 101. We have the charging cable here, uh, which it's a rechargeable unit. We have a gas hood, uh, which we really probably wouldn't use, and the unit itself. So the unit's uh, nice. It's fairly light. It's not too heavy. It's nothing that's going to cause you any difficulty using it, exploring mines like we do. So here you can see the screen that has uh, all the gases and the uh, current reading. We have hydrogen sulfide, uh, carbon monoxide, and then LEL, or lower explosive limit. We're talking about concentration of thermal gases or vapors in the air on that one. And then, of course, O2. And it does have three uh, types of alarms, uh, visual, audible, and tactile, and a 14-hour battery life. That's more than adequate for what we do. The clip on the back here, you have this uh, where you can hang it, or um, if you want to wear it, which we do, this clip is nice and tight, so it's not going to come off or fall off. A uh, key with this is obviously if you're in a mine that has water in it, you just want to make sure this is worn above the water level because it is water resistant, but not waterproof. That's just something to keep in mind. I've had one go in the water before, not this particular unit, but another one. I do like these clips. I think that's a great feature. It's got a nice feel to it, uh, easy to hold on to. It's got a protection little cover here for the uh, recharger. All in all, it's a good looking unit. It's what we would expect and like to see. So we're gonna go ahead now and uh, get up to the mine and we're gonna give this a try in the field. So we're gonna go ahead and power it up. And of course you can see as it starts here, going through all of its checks. And we have our O2 reading and all of our other pertinent readings here. So we're gonna go ahead and clip this on and wear it uh, throughout the mine today. We have our gas meter uh, clipped on here. Uh, we always carry one of these whenever we explore. This just happens to be a new one we're trying. It was given to us by Toptis. Kind of show you how we wear it. We hear it while we're in there. Hopefully not, but. All right, there's our oxygen. So we got our monitor going. We are at 19.2% there. Just to show you what we got going on here. 18.8. All right, so it looks like we have some possibly original carbide graffiti. Um, it says safety first. Hey everyone, Timoth Ghost Towns, Washington. And as you just saw, we gave our top test uh, gas detector, four in one, a field test in the mine, and it did exactly uh, what we had expected to do. We had an unexpected encounter with a drop in O2, and it picked it up just like it should have. Well, I would recommend this unit. I think this is a very nice unit. If you go out and do stuff like we do, um, explore mines, it's a good idea to have safety equipment like this. Down below, you'll see our discount code. If you uh, want to go ahead and purchase one, you can go to Amazon. Uh, thanks again for watching, and we'll see you next time.